So, as you can tell, there's a lot of things that need to be done to my car. One of them being that I either need new headlights or I need to try to clean these up because my headlights, I don't know if you can tell, but they're a little, they're a little foggy. And then look at this compared to my brother-in-law's headlights. He's got the same car, but not the SS and his are like completely like just so much brighter. So Jay realized that's another thing she's got to check to get. Okay. But that's not what we're doing today. Today we're no longer going to have a fish bowl. <laughs> ah, such a nice sound. <laughs> And for my birthday, since we're going off on what I got here and what I need to get. One second. <laughs> so I bought subs for my last car and I was really bummed out when I got a new car and had to just kind of set these ones in here because nothing was hooked up yet. Well, for my birthday, I have such an amazing husband and our friend Ryan who went through and put them in so I finally have subs again so um and there's a couple more things that we need to do but we'll talk about that throughout the day so after fighting with um ew, I look gross from that angle so after fighting with Siri I finally got her to take me to the directions of my doctor's appointment we'll be there in like 30 minutes and then my doctor's appointment is probably like 20 minutes and then we will go to lunch with Kayla and then go get tent done. So a couple other things that I wanted to talk about getting done was, sorry, I'm not like paying attention because I'm driving. A um, couple things that I wanted to talk about getting done is obviously my car at some point needs to be lowered. I feel like it would look a lot better. And then we also wanted to, um, or I, want to get credits to get it tuned so that it can stay in for or to stay in eight cylinder mode because it has the deactivation and I like spit a lot of oil when I go from eight or when I go from four to eight so we're gonna do that and then I'm also obviously gonna buy the tune for future like updates and stuff like that which won't happen right now but when I get a new job I'll obviously end up doing like a lot more so I want to get it lowered the tune then we're gonna do like I don't know that's all I have like planned for right now I guess and then new headlights I think that's it oh and then that's it <laughs> so yeah so stay tuned for my day with Zach's vlog we're at my doctor's appointment now. I gotta go because I'm almost late, but um, I'll be back after. So I forgot to record pretty much everything, but Kayla and I went to lunch. I met Kayla, she's one of my best friends. She works in Frankenmuth, so while like we're doing the little wait between my doctor's appointment and this appointment, um, we went to Taco Bell and Subway. And now we're on our way because he said that he could get me in at 1 instead of 2.30, so thankfully we can do that. Um, while everything's going on, like I'll get a good before and a good after shot, but um, I'm going to go hang out at my parents for a couple hours because they live like 20 minutes away from where all this is happening. And uh, he said it would take two to three hours and I really don't want to wait in a waiting room, so yeah. Also, sorry if me vlogging isn't what you expected. I don't do this and I suck at it, so yeah. It's okay. Thanks for picking me up. You're welcome. It's my mom's whip. And I'm gonna go visit my grandma. Or my aunt. They live in the same house. Going to pick up my car. I'm 
Min me mom's ka. Broom broom. <laughs> That's who did it, just in case you guys are wondering. He's really good. Everything looks so good. So I can't roll down my windows for three days. And I gotta keep it in the sun. Looks so good. Alright, so Jay looks a little rough today, so put on some sunglasses and hope that did something. Anyways, we're taking the husband's truck today. Let's do a good before. Yesterday I really didn't get a good before because I suck. Anyways. This is before, so uh, let's go see what it's gonna go look like. All right, I'm a little shorter, so I'll just scoot that up. Holy crap, it's hot in here, and after you get the tank, you can't roll with the windows down, so that's what we're gonna do now. Anyways, while well, his truck is getting done again, I'm gonna, <laughs> his truck getting done again but since we're going to get one of the cars done again I'm gonna go to my mom's house I'm gonna go swimming might film it I'll let you know so it says we're gonna get there at 2 10 and I don't have an appointment until 2 30 and yesterday I was like insanely early so um, I am going to enjoy the ride today I'm going to enjoy the drive and take my time and go look at some stuff I guess for 20 minutes yeah I went swimming but we are back we got Zach's truck done um, and I'm ready to show you all right he got the same as me but he already had tint in the back um, from factory so his is a little darker Alright guys, so there you have it. Um, hope you guys liked Jay's little vlog she did for you. She actually did a lot more than I expected her to. I filmed getting the tent. She kind of recorded during the day, which worked out because it gave you guys some extra little content. But, so we did end up going with 15% for the both vehicles. Um, she got 50% all the way around. It, was, it had no tent from factory, so everything is 15. Here's looking in from the sun. It actually... The camera makes it look a tad bit darker. Actually, I lied. It's what it looks like on camera. The light has to hit it right, but this is what it looks like. And 
then same thing with mine. I did a 15 all the way around, but like she said, I already had tint. I, I don't know why mine looks lighter up front, but maybe that's just because my rears have 15 over 20. Same thing with the back. I'll show you what it looks like on the inside. We didn't do anything with the windshields. And this is what it looks like on the inside. Which looks normal. The camera was not gonna pick up the feeling, but it does pick up the difference. For sure. It does make it look a little more, it, it's definitely more driver focused in here. Uh, that's the difference between 15 and 15 over 20, right there. So I can kind of get the house on it. There's an idea. Oh, and that's nothing, 15. Uh, like I said, the camera's not gonna pick it up as well as in person. Of course, it never will. Oh, but I'll show you what the car looks like on the inside. There's a difference. This has more room back here, and if you open this up, it kind of feels almost the same, but you do feel more, you do feel more like in the car. It's hard to explain, but you, I don't want to say it's more of a privacy thing because privacy, like, that's personal opinion. I don't care about privacy. I care about, like, it is kind of cool and you can't see the person next to you, but I don't, like, privacy wasn't my big deal. I was more of, like, how it looks and how it just feels on the inside. You feel more inside the car. I'm sure everyone who's watching this has probably been inside of a car with tent, so you probably understand what I'm saying. Um, but I'm going to keep this video kind of short, so there you go. Both got tent. Uh, two days apart from each other and they're looking pretty good They were but definitely in need mainly for that car But that was also needed it. I've been wanting to do that for a while, but I never got to it And then it really the tent really brings out her this car looks honestly great And I'm actually really proud of my wife for how clean she's making this car. The wheels are a great choice We're gonna paint correct the car soon. Um, the car looks good and well with the tent it really brings out this chrome piece so I don't know what we're gonna do with that. It's, it actually brings it out more in person than on camera. It doesn't look terrible. I don't know if it would look right black because then it wouldn't match this. Like that would be a different black. Like if we wrapped it or something or sprayed it, it wouldn't match that. It would kind of be like different, different, different. So I don't know what we're gonna do with that, if, even if she wants to do anything with it. And then she needs new headlights. Her headlights pop even more now, um, but we'll see. The truck, aesthetically, that's about all I'm gonna do with the truck, aesthetic-wise. Everything you see here is pretty much done, except because I did hit something in Florida with my bumper, now I have to fix that, and I'm not going to just put it back to stock. I'm actually gonna do a, well, it's gonna be stock, but it's gonna be a 13 and up conversion with the vertical fog lights and a different grill and bumper. Um, so that's gonna be, otherwise, that's gonna be it, aesthetic-wise, so. They're looking good. We are in the Bend, Michigan area. He's my cousin's cousin, so we kept it within the family to help support the family, and he just does a really good job anyway. Here's his logo. All Out Tint and Customs. He's on Facebook and Instagram, so check him out. And thank you so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit that like button. Hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you in the next vlog.